So it's day three. Um, we're basically doing final check down with all the O2 kits. So I've got the regulator plugged in, my full mask exhaust system, um, the helmet, uh, and my oxygen system routed over the top here. So it's a basically check out for the entire system to make sure I'm happy with it from normal altitude, which means if there's any issues with the O2, it's not an issue because I can breathe the ambient air. Um, whereas obviously when I go to high altitude, I won't be able to do that. So today is basically making sure this all fits together um, and I can happily, safely fly it. Um, and then uh, if there's any tweaks we need to make, we can make those. Key issues are that I don't actually have anything moving around, um, so there's no flapping of any of my uh, hose gear, and it's all clear so I can get to my emergency handles should I need to use them and I can deploy safely. Um, and obviously the fact that my oxygen system is all working perfectly and I'm not going to breaks in the seals, um, and just making sure it's fundamentally safe. Well, the helmet was actually really tight to get shut, um, but we got it shut, that was fine. And the flight was fine. All systems worked. Um, slightly strained my shoulder trying to shut the damn helmet, but um, when I actually do it on the day, I won't be doing it myself, I'll have Tad there to fit it, so it's not really an issue. The good thing is when it is shut, it's a super tight fit, which is what I need. So yeah, very happy with that. And what I want to do now is focus on the Aurora uh, and fly that. Um, and also the bottle's now decharged, so what I shall probably do is de-shit this now, rig up the Aurora, uh, which is the specialised container for the flight, and uh, go and test jump that. The Aurora is, is a performance um, container. Its design is basically designed in such a way that it's uh, really effective in terms of low drag. What I'm looking for is that nice safe deployments, um, and that effectively I've got no snags again with any movement in the body, um, and then there's nothing conflicting when I've got the O2 bottles on it. The flight was good, we were safe. Um, all oxygen systems worked, so uh, yeah, I'm very happy with that. <laughs>